Thank you very much. Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, I have the honor to attend this conference on behalf of His Excellency, the Egyptian Ministry of Transport. Due to previous commitments, all the Egyptian people are proud with Baba Kar Nadai Prize that was awarded His Highness President Abdel Fattah Sisi. And I would like to thank Actual Roots and MIFA for this appreciation to the Egyptians for its development to the road sector. Dear attendees, the positive political stability that Egypt witnessed is leading to build up a long-term vision and sustainable development strategy for the country until the year 2030 will develop. This sustainable development strategy, Egypt 2030, aims to create a modern, open, democratic, productive, and heavy society. A participatory planning approach was adopted to prepare sustainable development strategy. The civil society organizations and the private sector were leading this process to ensure the enforcement and implementation of policies, programs, and initiatives that will be adopted to achieve the target of strategy. Obviously, uh, obviously the increasing of freight and passenger flows between Egypt and African countries and the world, urging the necessity of developing a sustainable transport sector approach, which is from one of the main pillars of the Egyptian plan 2030. Egypt was historically being equipped with the necessary attributes to facilitate trading whether internally or with neighboring countries, where Egypt is idly located on the major trade routes close to many of the world's major gross economies. So that the Egyptian political leadership worked, worked in the uh, capitalization of this gift, of this God gift that gave Egypt this strategic location by developing and constructing a huge road, a huge road network up to 5,000 kilometers of the new constructed roads, in addition to a rehabilitation of 9,600 kilometers from the existing road. This revolution in the road sector makes the Egyptian road network. In addition to rehabilitation of 9,600 kilometers from the existing road, this revolution and road sector makes the Egyptian road network reach about 55,000 kilometers. That is the connection of all the Egyptian government government rates. On one hand, with the seaboards and land boards, land border boards, and the neighbor countries. On the other hand, through horizontal and vertical corridors. In this regard, number of overnight bridges was constructed, where 38 bridges only were existing before 2014. Over the Nile, by the rate of one bridge every five years. And now we plan to execute 21 overnight corridors with the rate of two corridors each year. In addition, road safety measurements are taken to be enhanced through planning to construct 61 overpass bridges at the rail road intersections with high severity where 18 bridges had been constructed as well as guideline for road safety inspection and road safety audit were set. Moreover, a special road for trucks were constructed to reduce number of accidents and, the, and its severity that had been reduced by 38% besides the road access control were enhanced. In this context, Egypt advanced 17 places in the road quality index to rank 
28 in 2019 compared to 45 in 2018. Since the emergence of globalization that shapes the path and trends of global trend and the flow through distribution channel and supply chain around the world. The need for integration and connectivity between the centers of production, trade, and the global business become indispensable. In this regard, the presence of efficient and sophisticated road network can lead to cost and time saving that enables the owners and dealer achieve competitive advantage that help them penetrate markets, gain profits, and provide better and faster service to their customers around the world. Apparently, according to 2030 Egyptian Sustainable Development Plan, and with the continuing increase of Egyptian population, new cities are being developed all over Egypt to increase the percentage of inhabited area and reduce high population densities. The number of cities in Egypt increased from 218 in 2007 to 230 in 2018. 12 new cities in 10 years. Currently, 15 new cities are being built in five years. Again, currently, 15 new cities are being built in five years. Finally, I saw this opportunity to thank Cote d'Ivoire for hosting this conference. And I would like to thank all of you for this chance that give us, that was given to us to express our appreciation and interesting and strengthening the relationships with our African brother. And we're looking forward to achieve the target of 2063 agenda. Thank you very much.